guys, welcome to another episode of Roughing It. Uh, today we're going to be talking about snake bites. Uh, it's starting to become, you know, it's, it's springtime, weather's warming up, the snakes are starting to get out. Uh, here in Missouri we have mostly copperheads, uh, we have water moccasins, and uh, in the southern regions we do have some, some rattlesnakes. So I'd say most importantly, before you go out in the woods, know, know what snakes are indigenous to your part of the country and uh, kind of prepare for that. Now this is uh, the snake bite kit. Um, I can't remember the brand name honestly. Um, you can get these at any of your local stores, Walmart. Um, a lot of the arm, uh, military uh, surplus stores sell these. And you've got pretty much everything besides the anti-venom in here to uh, get you by until you can get to the hospital to get the anti-venom. Okay, and I'm going to show you how this thing works. So inside this little kit, I already took all the stuff out. You've got you've got a uh, antiseptic swab. Okay, comes with a scalpel. It comes with a limb restrict limb constrictor. Okay, you can use this. You can use paracord if you got it. Anything to cut the blood flow off to the bite, keep the venom from going back up through your, through your system, okay? First thing you're gonna wanna do is pop this open. You wanna crush this, and then you wanna take the anti-venom, and you wanna, you wanna clean the area, okay? Some of the indications of that were, you know, like I said, pain, uh, swelling, but also uh, dry mouth, and uh, so after you put the antiseptic on, you're going to want to take this limb constrictor. And I'm just going to say that, let's say that I got it on my arm, okay? You want to pull that thing tight. You want to try to cut the blood flow off, okay? Now you want to try to keep this within about an inch, inch and a half of the, of the bite, okay? Once you get that put on there, you want to take your uh, the scalpel that came with this thing, and you want to make eighth to quarter inch incisions over each of the bites. Okay, you want to make sure that you don't go into, you know, if you got it up here, you don't want to cut into one of your major arteries. That could be really bad. You could bleed out, and then you're really screwed. Okay. Um, once you make those incisions, the nice thing about this is the tube. That this comes with is also a suction cup so you don't have to stick your mouth up to it and try to suck it out and as you can see this is kind of contoured so it'll fit over your skin put it on there pull it up and you can see it's sticking okay you want to try to get you want to try to get most of the venom out within an hour of the bite um, every 10 minutes, you know, or as a swelling spreads, you want to loosen the constrictor for a minute and reapply it a little closer to the heart. So back up your arm, um, you know, beyond the swelling. So just keep doing that and uh, that ought to get you hopefully to the hospital. Hopefully you guys never have to experience this. Um, in all my years, I've come across, you know, many venomous snakes, um, and luckily, you know, just paying attention to your surroundings, um, knowing where snakes like to hide, um, knowing the time of year when they're out, and, uh, you know, obviously, if the old, the old rule, if you come across a piece of wood laying on the ground, you're going to pick it up, always kick it first. Well, thanks for watching this episode, guys. I hope you learned a little bit and hope you stay safe out there. And uh, don't forget to check out my Facebook page. Uh, it's uh, Roughing It, R U F N I T, Survivor's Journal. And uh, throw, me some, uh, throw me some comments out there. I'm always posting up questions, uh, tips. And if you guys have any tips, uh, please throw them up on the page. Uh, don't forget to hit the like button on this video and subscribe to my channel. I try to get a video out about once a week. It's kind of hard to do sometimes, but uh, I do my best. And I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this and took something from it. Be prepared. Dream with
Feathers of angels stuck beneath